Summary Annalise's reluctance to post about Clayton on her social media raises suspicions about her true intentions, especially considering her dad doesn't even know he exists. Annalise's refusal to have physical intimacy with Clayton, even when they finally meet in person, leaves him confused and worried about the future of their relationship. Clayton's discovery that Annalie has been lying to her dad about their relationship and her true reasons for going to the U.S. suggests potential ulterior motives, such as obtaining a green card. 90 Day Fiancé star Annalie Vallejos could be faking her love for Clayton Clark just so she can get a green card after marrying him. Clayton, a 29-year-old from Kentucky, stars in season 10 with Annalie, 26, from Peru. Clayton became famous after the season trailer showed Clayton's mom Violet living in his closet inside a one-bedroom apartment he shares with his two guinea pigs and two chihuahuas. Annalie has now moved into the same apartment, which is a big culture shock for the Peruvian woman. Annalie also has been showing some red flags of her own, which could mean she's not marrying Clayton because she's in love with him. Annalie and Clayton met on a language learning app. She was studying English, and he was learning Spanish on it. One day, Clayton noticed that Annalie had visited his profile. He decided to message her to ask why she had visited his profile and didn't even say hello. That's how they ended up chatting. Clayton thought Annalie was super pretty. It was the first thing he noticed about her. Clayton liked that she was very talkative and super sweet. They started messaging in Spanish, and after about three weeks of chatting, Annalie and Clayton developed feelings for each other. Annalie said a delayed yes to Clayton's proposal Clayton and Annalie were in a long-distance relationship for eight months. Clayton decided he wanted to see Annalie in person. He booked a trip to go to meet her in Peru. After meeting her in real life, Clayton realized he loved Annalie because she was very thoughtful and affectionate. On day four of their spending time together Clayton realized he had never loved someone as much as he loved Annalie and proposed. However, when he proposed, Clayton didn't quite get the response he was looking for. He expected Annalie to jump with happiness when he asked her to marry him. Instead, Annalie said, ah, and didn't say anything else. She didn't even say yes to Clayton, which left him feeling confused. Clayton himself asked her if her, ah, meant, yes. Annalie eventually said, yeah, which Clayton described as a delayed yes. Clayton is hoping that Alani didn't agree to marry him just out of coercion or force. He remained hopeful because he somehow did manage to get a, yes, from Annalie in the end. He took that as a win. What Clayton did not realize was that Annalie may not have meant, yes, and was saying it so he would not have his heart broken. Annalie's dad doesn't know that Clayton exists although Clayton had never met his online friend Cameron in person, he shared his deepest secrets with his online friend. Clayton wanted to run a strange scenario by Cameron in episode 5. He thought the situation was so weird that whenever he thought about it, he didn't want to tell people about it. He reminded Cameron that he had been together with Annalie for over two and a half years. However, Annalie's dad didn't even know Clayton existed the whole entire time. Cameron thought the situation was kind of alarming, especially because Annalie was close to her dad. Annalie's dad called her an abnormal amount of times in a day. Sometimes, he called her 20 times a day, which meant Annalie and her dad were very close. Clayton had been avoiding telling Cameron about this because he felt disappointed by the fact that Annalie wanted to keep him hidden. Clayton had been in past relationships that dealt with the same issue. 
He didn't want to relive the experience, which meant he would have to deal with insecurities that he had already overcome. Now that Clayton had started to talk about it again, the insecurities had returned. Clayton wondered if Annalie wasn't proud of their relationship. He wanted to know whether Annalie was ashamed of showing him off. Clayton knew Annalie had been lying to her dad the entire time. When Clayton and Annalie used to meet, it was not in her hometown but in Lima, the capital of Peru. She told her dad that she was going to Lima for work. Annalie even told him that she had a job waiting for her in the U. S, and not that she was going there to get married. Annalie had told Clayton that her dad was overprotective and intense. Clayton had already dealt with a lot of trouble while getting Annalie to America and didn't want her to risk telling her father, who might tell her not to go. Annalie refuses to have physical intimacy with Clayton as Annalie got comfortable with Clayton's house, he told the cameras that it might not be possible for him to have an intimate relationship with Annalie, with his mom being 10 feet away in the walk-in closet. In the past, whenever he had girlfriends over, his mom would leave the house or shut herself in her closet and turn the radio on to give Clayton some privacy. He expected something like that to happen during his first night with Annalie. However, instead of being intimate with Clayton, Annalie pushed him to the corner of the bed and used a soft toy as a partition between them. Clayton figured Annalie would have liked to be intimate after being apart for a few months, but she let him down by going to sleep immediately. Clayton understood that Annalie may have been tired from traveling for so long, or perhaps she was uncomfortable with his mom's presence next door. Clayton didn't know what to think of Annalie's reaction but admitted he was worried about it. Annalie doesn't post about Clayton on her social media the preview for the next episode of 90 Day Fiancé shows Clayton, Annalie, and his mom at a dinner meet up with his family. A lady asks him why Annalie doesn't have photos together on her social media. Clayton tells her it's because Annalie's dad does not know he exists. Clayton's relative suspects it means Annalie is using him for a green card. I can't imagine her faking something like that for two and a half years, Clayton replies. Annalie not posting about Clayton is surely a red flag. However, it remains to be seen if 90 Day Fiancé's Annalie will eventually tell her dad. 90 Day Fiancé airs Sundays at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on TLC. Source, 90 Day Fiancé, Instagram 90 Day Fiancé release date, the 12th of January 2014 cast, Sean Robinson main genre, reality genres, romance, drama, reality TV seasons, 9 network, TLC streaming service, TLC Go franchises, 90 Day Fiancé directors, Rogue Rubin, Kevin Rhodes, Jessica Hernandez showrunner, Kyle Hamley.